Now this is one of the newest hotels on the Thailand scene. It's the Sofitel So Bangkok. And I'm here today to sniff around, literally. Let's go. I was actually here to discover the work of a company called Air Aroma. For well over a decade, the international Air Aroma team has been scenting hotels and other spaces throughout the world. That means they capture the brand identity of a venue and translate it into a smell that makes visitors feel good and linger longer. Thailand-based Air Aroma scent master Tony Wright helped design the Sofitel So's signature scent of a rainforest aroma throughout the lobby to blend with the hotel's great view over Bangkok's Lumpini Park. Downstairs though, the hotel has a chocolate factory cafe called Choco Lab, so a different aroma was required. Tony, we walked around the lobby where of the obvious scent that you have there is rainforest That's right, looking yes. over Lumpini. Yes. We're down here on the ground floor and you've got a different scent operating here, don't you? Yes, we do. Uh, because of the Choco Lab uh, that is here, normally we wouldn't recommend that there be a different scent in the lower lobby and the upper lobby because what we're looking to try and do is imprint in the client's mind this is the aroma of this brand. But here it makes sense. There is a, a chocolate store right here. What else would we do but have a, a chocolate aroma? So we have choc berry. Choc berry, yes. yes. Is that, I guess that sort of entices people to start eating, doesn't it? That's the plan. That's very much the plan. We're looking for increased retail sales. And in fact, that does happen. We have found that where there is an aroma emanating from a particular area, people follow their noses uh, and go in. So we're gonna drag them by their nose into the store. <laughs> For Hotel General Manager Gilles Cretelaz, the right scents are important for all hotels. We get uh, very good uh, support from Air Aroma. They are doing a fantastic job in this hotel. So we try to, to bring a specific scent uh, to the hotel so people will remember. And something quite interesting is we have selected the chocolate scent. I, I think it's always interesting, especially for a new hotel, to have a story to tell. I think it was important to come up with something new in Bangkok. There's so many beautiful hotels in Bangkok, as you know. So if you want to be successful, the only way is to come up with something interesting to share with our customer. So the idea was, in fact, let's do a new hotel with five Thai designers, because the main focus of this hotel is on the Thai culture. But around those five designers, just come up with a story, and we have actually chosen the idea of the Chinese feng shui. Our next stop was Bangkok's Sukhumvit Road. A tuk-tuk ride will bring you up close to some of Bangkok's other aromas. Well, Tony, this is one way to experience the aromas of Bangkok. And there certainly are a lot of aromas that are sale one in Bangkok. Yeah. It can be quite daunting for a newcomer. Yes, all those uh, street food we've got happening over here. We've got, of course, all the great pollution. Yes. like you have in any big city. Yes. So that's why it's so nice to actually arrive in an environment where the smell is beautiful. That's exactly correct. It, so, it, it becomes an oasis. So we're looking forward to that right up ahead. Just around the corner. Now, if you sniff around this hotel, the aroma that you'll notice is jasmine, which is not only one of the most beautiful, it's also one of the most expensive essential oils in the world. The signature scent here is very different and noticeable as soon as you arrive. Well, Tony, we've arrived here at the Rembrandt, I guess one of the more established hotels in Bangkok, and Certainly. I've arrived to this amazing aroma. Can you tell me? How do you decide what aroma is going to suit the hotel? Actually, there needs to be congruence between the, the lobby, the place, the environment, and the aroma. But the main point we look at is the demographic of the hotel. There are different aromas that suit different races. There are different aromas that suit young and old people. So we try to find out from the hotel who their demographic is, who their clients are, and then we try and match up the aromas that would suit those particular clients. The Rembrandt's GM has a keen sense of smell. I think most people don't realise that we have aroma 
but this comes from I met Tony a few years ago and I think I believe we were one of his first customers here uh, but at the time we just finished renovating the lobby and I thought it's a good idea to do the aroma and we tried it out and most people they don't realize they just say oh it's so nice to come to your hotel because it smells so fresh yes yeah. uh, or it's it's such a good feeling coming to your hotel they don't really realize what it is that makes it we actually opened 19 years ago and we were one of the first hotels around here I guess uh, we have 407 rooms we have we're very well known for our restaurants like Rang Mahal, Senyu Pico, Red Pepper but also our European food is very good we have an Italian restaurant Da Vinci beautiful pool coffee shop and um, I think we're doing generally very well we've renovated well during the past few years yeah. and just now the last couple of months we've just changed the new air conditioning systems so more energy friendly and less carbon footprint. The scents are delivered through the air conditioning system and with permission we went behind the scenes to take a closer look. Well we got permission from security and we're behind the scenes now in the hotel and, and Tony um, I guess this is where it all happens isn't it? It is, this is the nerve centre. Uh, over here we have the control box that controls the amount of scent and the frequency of scent and how it goes into the system and here we have the bottle of essential oil and what is called a cold air diffuser which sends the essential oil into the air conditioning ductwork. Ah, so what's the advantage of having it go through the aircon system? The advantage of that is that wherever the air goes, wherever the cold air goes, the scent, the aroma also goes. If we, if we, didn't, if we weren't able to do that, we would have to have a, uh, a different style of diffuser in the lobby somewhere, which would be perhaps an eyesore or perhaps not as effective as this one is. But this is very, very effective in getting the aroma out into the lobby area. And that keeps it sort of circulating through. It does indeed, yes. The air conditioning system is zoned in a, in, a, in a hotel. So one air conditioning unit does one zone, another one does a different zone. So we can target which areas we want to send. The right scent seems to make sense in the hotel business. In fact, smell is considered our most powerful sense when it comes to the long-term memorizing of experiences, places or products. So if you want to create a lasting impression, then put your nose to work. <laughs>